Howdy folks, this is Jackers, back again with another episode of our Fallout New Vegas Let's Play, this time with episode 100. And, uh, I don't really have anything special planned for episode 100, unless of course we get to set the gala off, that might be cool. Fallout New Vegas had something special for me, I got about a quarter of the way through the episode earlier before I passed into another zone, and, well... The thing happens that happens, and Fallout New Vegas went away. So we're going to uh, try and do it all over and see if I can not have a split memory about it. Anyway, I will turn it over now to Checkers, the Courier. Yeah, you know, sometimes it just feels like deja vu all over again. So we're going to talk here What's to Dean. What's that him floating above the fountain, the boss man? The one who put these bow ties on our necks? It surely sure was. Does like to make a presentation. We should keep it down or else the ghost people are going to swarm the gates. Vera hologram or no. Well, do you know anything about this gala event we're supposed to trigger? Supposed to be the grand opening of the Sierra Madre. Lots of lights, music, the works. And he's going to use the gala event to open the casino? But that's interesting. Why, it sure is interesting. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Yeah. Maybe the drain in power. That'll cause the security systems to shut down enough to let us in. But getting back out? That's not what no, I was thinking. The place will close up tighter than an opening at the fronds. Or Danny Parker's sphincter when he has to tip a doorman. So the gala's tied to the casino's generators. Right, look. So, not everything about the villa was the pinnacle of bright ideas. In order to pull off the gala, old Sinclair had to get creative. The Sierra Madre announcement, for example. Not just for the casino, not at all. The gala's tied to the casino, draws on its power. Might cause it to reset itself, open the doors for a bit like it was supposed to. What do you mean about the Sierra Madre's broadcast? Well, Vera's beautiful voice doesn't run on casino power, exactly. Her broadcast is tied into the emergency broadcast signal for the Sierra Madre. You know, in case of attack. Well, guess what? The night of the gala event, the emergency signal went out all right. But because the broadcast had been hooked up to the gala event, Instead of an emergency signal, you get Vera's voice on the radio. Great, huh? So, it's not an invitation at all. It's a call for help. Yeah. The Sierra Madre's last song. One only a few people are ever going to hear. A little sad, but what can you do? Well, according to the marker, you're slated for a spot in Puesta del Sol. No. Looks like a rooftop in Puesta del Sol. Pretty sure in that's what I said. Nice view. Now, it's the last place anyone wants to stand when this event goes off. That place during spring, summer and fall, a little bit in winter, is a prime resort spot for ghost people. Not the best of neighborhoods. If we're going there, I'm not going alone. And if you have any bright ideas about telling me to stroll over there, or leave me there, no thanks. Well... Any idea why he wants you there? Partner, I'm not sure this guy's operating with a full deck. My bet? Process of elimination, lowest common denominator. He figures the strong man's needed somewhere, even if it sounds like the strong man's two minds about it. Plus, I'm guessing wherever old doggy boy's needed doesn't need smarts. I hope not. Or we're royally jonesed. And the woman, the autodoc victim. What about her? Little Miss Silence? Maybe she needs to be in some place where she can be seen, but being heard isn't important. And me? I've had prime billing in Europe, New York, and this gig doesn't feel like that. 
Don't get me wrong, I can hold an audience, conduct a score from the rooftops, but I'm guessing I'm the odd man out in this whole heist. I'm not following you. Odd man out, dead weight. Someone you need holding the toolbox, the nurse passing the scalpel, the chauffeur driving you to the concert. Any guy with hands is who he needs up on that rooftop. Guess he thinks I don't rate looking like I do. Poor him. All right, that's enough for now. I'd shed a tear, but I'm sure we'll be chatting again. Oh, well, yeah, right Didn't this very minute. Much of our chances. All right. Um, think we should travel together. Strike up the band. Domino's back in town. All right. We've got the unclean living perk. We're going to space time here so I don't have to go through all that once more. Because premonitions are hard enough when you're scattered on the floor. All right, this back down into... Down on my knees. Yeah, mine too. I keep telling you that. So we're just going to have to suck it up and go. We've got some hulls, some chips. Wait, did we even check that room? Ever? I'm thinking no. But I could be wrong. Well, alright, let's move. Got another chip here. And this is where we lost it. Pressing the space-time key and heading to Puesta del Sol North. Alrighty, here we are again, having failed to go through the door. Let's see if third time's the charm. Alright, so this would be the fourth time we try and go through there, but we're not going to try and go through there right now. We're going to try and see if there is any possible other junction. Let's try the medical district and see if we can cross into there. And I've read different sort of theories, so we'll try one, see if it works. This will be attempt number five to try and get through there. I think what we're going to try and do, even though it may be entirely foolish, is uh, lighten our load as much as we can. Detonate. I don't even know what that does. Oh, let's put half of them in there. Hopefully I'll remember to... I've done this. If anyone, you know, happens to remember for me, I'd appreciate it. I don't know if this is going to help. We're going to try a couple things. All right, sugar bombs, martini, scotch. Bound to 177. I guess we could try just dropping all of it, but maybe that'll be step six or, you know, whatever we get to. Throw in half our wonder glue. Sometimes it's like putting a puzzle together. All right, pressing space time. We're going to wait. We're going to attempt to wait. We cannot wait. Oh, wonderful. Just making me happier by the moment no not that I'm gonna pick up some rounds though let's pick up six all right pressing space-time key cannot wait cannot wait cannot wait Dean you're pushing your luck man you really are All right. Well, I don't have much hope for this. I don't know if there's another junction. <coughs> could, oh, you! You know there are just times when things don't go well. Welcome to episode 100.
four energy cells, four microfusion cells, four energy cells, and five microfusion cells. Dirty water, don't care about. Share and share alike. All right. You've got to be kidding me. Oh, well, you know. This crouching's hell on my knees. Say it again. One more time. I might be getting cranky. Hard to say. I do not believe it. I do not believe it. We made it through there. I guess I gotta threaten Dean more often. All right. Let's head through the hole. Dean. If we go backstage, we avoid the locals. Of course. He's getting too quiet. Well, there's a wasted wasteland, wild wasteland thing going on over there. Don't know what it was. to have checked on what the wild wasteland thing was but there is not time for that oh good this is what we had time for well let's finish this up we won't have to worry about that again um five in guns uh, let's put at least two in medicine Five in sneak. And... Let's put a couple points in speech. Continue. Alright, now we've got to actually look at something. Because I have not. We've been f focused on uh, one... For so long... This isn't bad. You can craft rounds out of scrap metal and tin cans. Light touch. Mm -hmm. Running gun reduces accuracy penalties for one-handed guns and energy weapons while walking or running. I kind of do use that. I do that. Gunslinger, don't care. Hand loader. That's not too bad either. Professional. Up close and personal, that's how you like it. Sneak attack, criticals, pistols, revolvers, submachine guns, guns or energy weapons. Inflict an additional 20 damage. I think we found our selection. Hi there. Anybody else still got one attached? No, that's good. All right, we're pressing the space-time key here. Dean, are you still alive? Good. Well, I mean, you know, objectively. Well, let's grab the insta-mash. Oh, yeah. Situation as per normal. Super stim pack, I guess we can do that. Have a Salisbury steak. Maybe some purified water. All right. Um... Let's see here. Junk food. I guess we may as well grab it at this point. We got rounds. We're good there. You sure came a long way to rough this place. Guess greed is in the blood. Why did it work and then not work? Why did it beep and then not beep? Dean, something real weird just happened. I feel like we should have been, you know, been kind of borked there. And we weren't. I mean, I'm not complaining. 
Wonder glue, I guess we can take it. Whatever it is, is there an upstairs or? Well, hello. Cash register here's got two bobby pins, two pre-war money, 51 Sierra Madre chips. We will crack this safe. go. Pre-war money and nine Sierra Madre chips. All right, five more. Well, so something's upstairs, I'm guessing. Don't know how rightly you get to that, but across there. All right, well, how do you get up there? First aid box, got two stim packs and some purified water. Can definitely use all that. Don't need a paint gun. Take the duct tape and the seven Sierra Madre chips though. Scrap metal, eight Sierra Madres and some wonder glue. We'll grab that. Yeah, you can keep all that. Oh, nuts. What did I just trigger? I don't even know what I just triggered. Seems like something not horrible, but... Oh! Rigged shotgun. Well, let's disarm it. I don't think we get any rounds out of it since we triggered it. But I could be wrong. No, we got one. Look at us go. All right, whatever the problem is, we gotta been getting close. Let's disarm that bear trap right there. Check this desk, get the six Sierra Madre chips. Take a look up there, nothing special. There's a chip right back there. Two more Sierra Madre chips. Sierra Madre is not getting any younger. All right. Well, Dean, I'm not sure exactly where you're supposed to go. I know you said you wouldn't stay there, but, you know. We all say a lot of things. Electric box fuse. That looks different. We're going to take that. We need to go somewhere over this way. Apparently, now. And I still don't know what was setting the collars to being so angry. Sure glad one of us knows what you're doing. Yeah, well, it ain't me. ways well I guess we could check these I don't know if anybody's carrying the key no nobody's carrying the key all right well now we know Sure glad one of us knows what you're doing. Absinthe, I guess we can grab that. Up and over. Oh, there's the safe. What is that? It's a little too frequent to just want to search around. Yeah, yeah, all right, up here, I get that. All right. 
All right, so this isn't where we... Okay, so what we're going to do is drop down here. Sure glad one of us knows what you're doing. Press the space-time key. Come over here, and whatever's beeping must be in this room, right here. I can help you with the cloud, not for long, though. All right, Dean, you go. I will see what I can get us into or out of here. Uh, Sierra Madre chips by nine. Okay, nothing in the desk. Uh, uh, all right, Dean, let's fall back out of here. All right, purified water by four. We'll take one. I guess another super stem pack. Pressing the space time key, we're going in again. Come on, Dean. A uh, large whiskey bottle. No, I don't care about that. Let's move. I thought I saw a staircase somewhere. It's blocked. All right, Dean, I'm being poisoned again. All right, well... One more time, Dean. One more time. I don't know if I checked this. Anything there? Nope. All right, we're out of here. His protection don't seem to either... Either I'm not getting... enough time... to recharge his protection. Or watch out if you see a prize lying around. The ghost people leave supplies as traps. Yeah, what we need now, Dean, is the key though. Alright. What we really need is some way to heal. There's a vending machine out here, I recall. Oh, and you know what? We have stim pack. All right, let's accept. It's a lot, but... All right. Pressing the space-time key. This is just tense. All right. So we're going back over here. Did we even take a look around here? I guess we Watch should. Out if you see a this crouching's hell on my knees. Yeah, yeah, Dean. I know. Ah, aren't the trees lovely this time of year? All blooming and green. Dean. Well done, Dean. Sure he's dead. I will make sure he is. A stick or something. Going to need a here. I really, really don't like those fellas. Yeah, Dean, it's worth going in here to finish it. Alright, let's get back out. See what... Oh, goody. There we go. Pressing the space-time key, though it does look like we need to go through here, Dean. Don't dive in for too long. Only so much I can do to... Well, that, that was exciting. I don't there, know. The switching station. That's where you'll need to bring the mute. The what? The who now? I'm on Dean, aren't I? Aren't I supposed to be doing Dean? Get Dean to Puesta del Sol South rooftop. Well, we're in Puesta del Sol North. Dean, oh, all 
Well done, Dean. All right. Um, let's show location. We are not far. All right, let's see if we can get Dean into place. I don't know how I'm getting out of here alive. Is that a... No, it's not a tripwire. I All can right. help you in the cloud. Not for long, though. All right, Dean, I get it. Simply amazing. 10,000 points of healing. Mm. Yummy. Wait. Dean, there's got to be some way. Alright, we're going in here. I'm actually going to leave this stuff. Got a worse grease smell down here than Danny Parker's hair on opening night. Back off, Dean. Not sure what it is. All right, we're going to have to... Not any power running to it. Oh, goody. Back off, Dean. Do any of these work? Hmm. We picked up a, a fuse, right? Not sure what it would go to. Not sure what's supposed to be powering this. Sticks down here. Dean. I can really smell anything. All right, terminal check. This thing, check. Any of this? Ten three fifty seven rounds, forty two Sierra Madre chips. Well, there's a few rounds. <sighs> Dean. What's this? We got an active terminal. Visit! Sinclair was a lot more level than I was expecting, especially after Mr. Yesterday's cracks. He's sharper than one of those knives, too. He asked a lot of good questions about the Foundation, some I couldn't even answer. Don't bother him, though. He knows engineering, that's for sure. Worried he's gonna see through the villa. See it for the cardboard town it is. Well, Sierra Madre chips. Contracts. We have a sweet deal here. I let Mr. Yesterday know that. Know that we might need to renegotiate our arrangement and move the percentage around. Left records in the maintenance in case things got difficult. Blow this death trap wide open. Agreed to discuss things in the switching station so we wouldn't be overheard. I'm guessing that's where you died, whoever you are. Sierra Madre chip. Oh, I'll take a cart and a cigarette. So let's kick the light on. Looks like it went off again. Getting real tired of 13 Sierra Madre chips. No offense. Three more. But you guys are lowering the bar. Buff out absinthe, looks like. Not that I'll be able to get it. The file cabinets here got 17 more chips. All right. Grab that wrench. Grab that chip. This is where we came from or where we're going to. Not sure. Not going that way. All right, down we go. 
So we don't want to go to the right. Once more from the top with Feenland. So trying not to, Dean. Trying not to. Sure glad one of us knows what to do. Can't say as I recognize this place. We got a terminal active. Survey schedule. Sinclair's coming tomorrow to check on the villa's progress. Told the boys to look sharp for the suit. Not bringing the big starlet though, so the boys were grumbling about that. Better watch himself. Might have a nasty fall in the switching station. Reading glasses can take those. They don't have any weight. This crouching's hell on my knees. Radio's off. All right. Now what do we got here? A file cabinet. We got 16 Sierra Madre chips. 21 more plus some Wonder Glue. A desk that's got nine more chips. Gonna leave those glasses behind. See if we can. Well, let's take a look. Just I need to be more careful. Can't take the Madre from me. Well, that's good to know. 16 more Sierra Madre chips. 10 more Sierra Madre chips. Is that that wiggling fellow we shot down? He just still wiggling out there? You go, sunshine, you go. Terminal is locked very hard. Let's open the safe, then we'll take a look at the terminal. Safe is open. Nine pre-war money. Sierra Madre chip. Desk. Uh, I'm not sure we might have looked in there already. Alright. Immaculate. One out of twelve. Mm. Subterranean. Two out of twelve. Probably not. Probably not. Let's see. Maybe? No. Alright. Time to start taking things out of the equation. Allowance is replenished. Um. Well, we got you already. No, nothing there. Got that. Got those. Okay. Alright. What do we got here? Well, I wish I knew what any of the original ones were. One for twelve. There we go. Authenticity. Um, more explosives. More demolition charges showed up today. Checked with Mr. Yesterday. He didn't know squat about the shipment and was only interested if anyone had made a buck off it. These something Seclara ordered, or is it another cock up like the knives? We got more than enough explosives already. What is High and Mighty planning to blow up the road to this place so no one can get up here? Activate hologram, huh? Alright, what does that do? Dean, what did I do? Oh, it's a security hologram. I think that's his yellow warning thing. Alright, you know what? I think... I think this is going to take longer than I thought. So, nothing special for episode 100 except a whole lot of false starts. <laughs> for the moment. And a, and a fella who's just a wiggling like a... Well, 
something unfortunate we won't mention. Anyway, I would like to say thank you so much for joining me on our uh, 100th episode here in Fallout New Vegas, or 100th journey, that is. Hope you found it entertaining and maybe even just a little bit informative. I would like to invite you to subscribe. And thank you kindly. If you are already subscribed to that other checkers, Felly, I'd also like to invite you to like and to share if you so desire. Most of all, though, I would like to ask you to please, please take care.